Hello, dragons! And we're back with another Project Zomboid Mod Showcase. And here's another one by KI5, the 82 Jeep J10. I don't know about you guys, but I can't wait to check this one out, so... Let's go! And here we are with the front view, back view, and side view for you guys. And under the hood, if you wish to pause your screen and take a look at this stuff, go right ahead and do so. And moving on to the back side of the vehicle, there is a nice little animation on the door, as well as a nice roof rack on top. It's completely optional, as well as the trunk space, which is a maximum capacity of 105. That's freaking huge, dude. And moving inside of the vehicle, nice little animation on the door there. Here's the options as follows, pretty much standard. We're going to start with a horn here. And also a standard horn. Moving on to the headlights. Here we go, boys. Ready, set, go. Boom, 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 boom. Freaking sweet, dude. Oh, I love the lights on top, dude. And that there is a standard version of the J10. I think you noticed, but there is also a spare tire on top. And if you thought that was it, boys, nope, we're not done yet. This is the mellow yellow version of the vehicle. Front view, back view, side view for you guys. And under the hood, here's your information here. If you wish to pause your screen and take a look at the stuff, go ahead and do so. And onto the back side of the vehicle, as you notice, there's a huge difference in what that vehicle previously looked like and this vehicle now. Also, the storage capacity on this beast has completely changed. It's only a bed storage of 45. And the thing inside of the vehicle, I think it's only aesthetics, but let me know. I couldn't figure out a function for it. And moving inside of the vehicle, we notice there is a difference with the headlights and the top lights. So we're going to go ahead and check that out real quick. Here we go, boys. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, yeah. Look at that top middle light. Nice and yellow. And that there is the mellow yellow version of the J10. As you can see, there is also a spare tire on the back of this vehicle. And just like most mods by KI5, this vehicle also has a bunch of 3D parts that are available. You can also take them off the car and only spread out some of the parts that are available to you. And where I parked the vehicle is pretty far, so I'm going to go ahead and take a shortcut. I'm going to use another mod by KI5 real quick. This thing's freaking sweet. I can't get over it. I got to drive it. Let's go, boys. Here we go. Oh, yeah. All right, boys, you know what comes next. It's a test drive. Let's hop in this thing. Let's get this prepped and ready. Here we go, boys. Oh, yeah. Off we go. A couple of things I do want to point out to you guys, and that is this vehicle has optional front and back bumpers with two-tiered protection. There's also a ton of variations in textures, so maybe you see the one you like. Go ahead and keep it. If not, move on to the next one. There's also optional armor protection for the engine, the windows, the doors, and more, including the headlights. And as far as driving this vehicle, I had an absolute blast, dude. My favorite thing about this vehicle would have to be the handbrake and the suspension. The suspension's a little bit crazy, but it might be designed that way, I'm not sure. But I love it. When you hit the handbrake on a hard turn, it rocks like a freaking boat, dude. I just can't get over it. It's freaking amazing. As far as everything else, the speed, the brakes, everything was great. I didn't have one issue with it. Let's just say if I did a Let's Play, this vehicle would definitely be in it. Let's Plays will come back, don't worry guys. But, it's gonna be some time. But man, I can't wait till they do come back. And that's it for this video. If you like this video, go and dragon smash that like button. And subscribe, become one of those dragons. Especially if you want more of these mod showcases. And I hope to catch you in the next one. Goodbye, for now.